Hey everyone, thanks for joining Learn to Play Games. My name is Lance, and in today's video I'm going to do an unboxing of Sniper Elite The Board Game. This is a new game by Rebellion Unplugged. It is a 1-4 to four player game that takes roughly 45 minutes to an hour and a half to play. And is a one versus many game, which means that most of the players will be playing the soldiers trying to break into these different facilities, and the other player is going to be playing the German soldiers trying to hunt down and stop the players from doing so. So in this video, I'm going to be unboxing the game and the deluxe version and then the expansion that I got with it. And I'm really excited about checking this one out. There is a group or a set of rules for the solo mode, which I'm really excited for. I really want to see how that's going to work. But I'm going to take you through and open up all this stuff and show you the cool things that are included in that. If you find the video helpful, if you like what I do, please consider that like button, subscribe to my channel. It's one of the easiest ways you can support channels like mine so I can continue to grow and be able to produce this content. If you want to get notifications anytime I release new videos, also consider ringing that bell so you get notifications when I drop new stuff. So let's head to the table and we'll see what's in the box. All right, so let's start by diving into the core game. So with this one, we have the rule book. So this is the main rule book. And it's going to give us our backstory and our contents, all the different things that we're going to get with this one. Our setup instruction, playing as the sniper. How to shoot, affecting the shoot bag. Playing as the defenders. And then the different maps and how to work with those. Line of sights, cards. Breakdown, yeah, looks like everything is broken down really well. We'll see once I start diving into the rules and how that works. And then we have a separate rule book for the solo rules, which is nice. So it's not just the afterthought. They've put a considerable amount of effort into this, it looks like. So that's really cool. Yeah, it's a pretty good amount of rules there for the solo mode. So I'm excited to check that out. All right. So then we have two boards. These are, I believe, for the, uh, the player controlling all the enemies. So he's going to be able to go through this. Either that or it's for the players. Like It's been a while, a couple years since I've had a chance to play this one at PAX Unplugged. So there's one. And then we have our second one here. There's the, uh, the submarine, it looks like. Very cool. And then the main board. So this will open up. And this is double-sided. So it has both of those sides. There's... Really cool, and let's see the other side. Okay, yeah, there's our, there's the boat. You got some missile, or maybe that's the, the torpedo factory or something. It looks like they're doing some work on it and that. Very cool. All right, and then we have our tray, so I'll just pull that out. We have all the different miniatures. Some of the different Germans and their different guns. And they've given them a wash. Looks like they're got some decent detail on them. Probably not the absolute best, but they are a smaller scale. Very cool. And we have our board for one of our characters. Some cubes. We got some clear ones and some colored ones. There's all the different bases for the different models. We have a die and solo sniper and defenders. Quick reference guides, the different tokens, and a pen, a wash, uh, re erasable pen for the, the other boards. There's another character there. And we have a, da a bag to be able to draw the tokens from. That'll randomize those different tokens. And then our cards. So we have solo cards. Fairly good deck of solo cards. Uh, we have some regular cards, almost like playing cards. And the German cards and American cards. So with these, these are different uh, items it looks like we'll be able to pick up. S mines, silenced ammo, distraction, sound masking, Tommy gun, trench gun. Okay, and then we have our different characters we have a medic and a scout the radio operator sniper kennel master 
we have sabotage the submarine. So maybe different objectives or something. Obtain the enemy sniper report. Yeah, so it looks like these might be those, but they're on uh, playing card. That's kind of cool. I like that graphic design there. So all the different things for that. And then the these are the solo cards. So we have all the different maybe objectives and things that we have to do. Retreat, hold position, guard all entries, ambush, installations, grenades, assignments. Okay, so these are different things we have to... Yeah, looks really cool. Oh, we got some more there. Very nice. And that is everything in the core box. All right, so next we have the Sniper Elite, the... Uh, Eagle's Nest. So this is the first expansion for it. So we have some expansion rules. So this is going to have us having some different characters there. And our map breakdown. Map breakdown. And some different weapons that we'll have. And then again, we have two more boards for the two different maps. And then our main map. Just open that up real quick. Check this one out first. So this is an interior location, probably a fancy mansion or something. And then we have an exterior location. So a lot smaller, like top down kind of thing. We've got a dam up there in that, really cool. And then finally, we have our four new characters. Cool. Major Easy and Rosa. We have some more solo cards. There's our different maybe objective cards again in that. So we have climbing gear, diving gear, knives. There's our different characters. <laughs> That's cool. And then more of these cards. And then, again, our different things for our solo mode. And finally, we have the Deluxe Upgrade Kit. So, let's see what we got here. Let's pop that out. All right, so we have some additional characters here. Very cool. Hitler having to go to the bathroom, it looks like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this guy looks like he's missing an arm. Oh, no. I'll have to uh, see if I can get a replacement for that. That's not so good. But we have all the different characters and an up a bigger bag for our tokens. And these will replace those punch-out tokens. These are really nice. Got some shot tokens, targeting tokens. Very cool. And sound, to, ooh, this looks like it's split there. That's not good. We got a couple of them there. That's got a, yeah, that's a full crack. Well, that's not so good. But I, I love the, the, the tokens. They've got a good weight to them and all that. Very nice. Just have to see about figuring out what to do with those cracked ones there. And then we got all of these. But yeah, overall, really nice. I mean, like, hopefully that's not an issue. There's a number of these here that have got some splits in them. So I wonder what happened there. Yeah, you can actually see through the split on that one. Other than that, these are really nice, though. They've got a really good weight to them. They feel really good. And that is everything with the deluxe box. So I hope you found the video helpful in seeing all the cool things with this. Let me know down in the comments below what other videos you'd like to see around this one. Would you like to see some playthroughs, maybe a teaching video or whatnot? Let me know in those comments and I'll see what I can do. Until next time, I'll see you later.